Hi, Camelback family. It's good to see you. I've been reflecting on the annual meeting from Sunday and thinking about how God is blessing our church. Uh, these words that we looked at in Ephesians chapter 3 last month came to mind. Ephesians 4, that we are to grow up in every way into him who is the head, into Christ, from whom the whole body, joined and held together by every joint with which it's equipped, when each part is working properly, makes the body grow so that it builds itself up in love. And I see our body growing as we build each other up in love. I saw it on Sunday at the uh, wonderful unity and spirit that we had in our annual meeting. So good to feel God's people together in harmony. I see that growing and building up in love in those who are serving. We had uh, 15 reports from ministry leaders and staff in our annual report and exciting to see all the different ways that God is using our body and they're just the tip of the iceberg. So as we think of our children and the Benevolence Fund and missions and weddings and funerals and all the different ways that we are serving each other in the community, the body grows. And Vacation Bible School is about to kick that into overdrive. So I see that happening as we are serving. I see it happening as God raises up leaders in our body too. So thankful for Mark Ortman and Nate Perkins who served as elders and did a great job. Thank you guys for your service. And really happy to welcome J.R. Sloan and Kirk Heisinger on as elders again for these next four years. God is raising up leaders. Um, he raised up Elizabeth Druitt to be serving as a classical worship director. Uh, ben Pratt has been one of our interns. He did the announcement on Sunday morning. And he is now in seminary and we've created a ministry associate position so that he can be working here at church while he's studying at seminary, focusing on young adults and singles, an important area, part of our body that uh, needs to grow. So God is working in our church and we are building ourselves up in love. It's a beautiful thing to see. And that was especially striking for me as I crunched the numbers, as I mentioned on Sunday, and realized that we've experienced a significant rebound as a church. Most churches lost about a third of their people over COVID, a very hard time uh, for churches, including Camelback. Last year at this time, we were still 13% behind where attendance was before COVID. And now for the last six months, we've been 7% ahead of where we were at this time before COVID. So a 20% swing and God is uh, uh, restoring and rebuilding. We're rebounding as a congregation and it's really exciting to see. Well, as we are growing together, just uh, one last note about our finances. We're about five, six weeks away from the end of the fiscal year, June 30th. And as we look at our uh, year to date budget, we're running about $108,000 behind where we had hoped to be at this point in the year. And so if you, uh, in addition to our, your regular giving, are able to help with this deficit that we've been running from earlier months, um, that would be fantastic. We're about $108,000 behind where we're supposed to be at this point uh, for our budget. God is doing wonderful things. He's building us together as a body as we work and serve and join our hearts together in worship and in ministry. I hope you have a great week. I hope that you feel God's presence and a smile on your life. God bless you.